gamma term is the X and the Y that are coupled on this bond, and you cyclically, cyclically permute it. So within the super exchange calculation, once you include DD uh, uh, hopping, as well as the oxygen mediated hopping, you generate this immediately. Essentially, uh, you go through the oxygen one way and then back through the orbital. So it's a cross term between this direct DD hopping and this oxygen mediated hopping. So I just want to emphasize that even without the distortions, this is not Heisenberg Cadet. Okay, so what does this do? So I've sort of organized this into a similar phase diagram as you saw in the last talk, where what I put is the Heisenberg Cadet model on the outside of this ring. Um, and then as you move in, you're turning on this gamma term. Okay, so in addition to all the phases we saw in the Heisenberg Cadet limit, there's actually two new sets of phases. So there's this 120 degree order, which is sort of reminiscent of something you might see in the triangular lattice, except it's sort of on both of uh, the sub lattices, the honeycomb. Uh, there's a new zigzag region here that comes in for large gamma, and there are incommensurate spiral orders that appear near the paramagnetic limit, paramagnetic cadet limit. So this is all uh, classical. Uh, so what are, what are these incommensurate phases? I sort of labeled them kind of roughly here. Uh, this one region just means that the dominant wave vector of the state is in the first brain zone. Two means it's in the extended brain zone. So this dominant wave vector changes as you move through the phases somewhat smoothly. Uh, they're not single cube states, so I'm not sure if I want to call them multi cube but they're, they're definitely not single Q uh, spiral states. And this phase one is actually quite energetically close to the zigzag phase. Okay, so again, these are highly quantum mechanical systems. Does this any of this hold up? To try to look whether quantum effects could be important here, we did a sort of a small scale exact diagonalization study, 24 sites. Um, so you can capture essentially everything except the spiral order in a cluster of that size. The 120 fits, the zigzag fits, the stripey fits. Um, and so you can see those clearly here where I've colored this phase diagram based essentially on the dominant part of the uh, static structure factor. And so here you can see